Hey guys, how's it going? So, um, let's see, today is Thursday, February, I mean, March 3rd, <laughs> and February 22nd, which was not this Tuesday, but the last one, I got my first shot of tea, testosterone, um, and my doctor, um, in D.C., his name is, uh, Dr. Cohen, he's an endocrinologist at the... George Washington University, um, it's called like Faculty Medical Center, and he started me on a um, 40 milligrams of testosterone and anthate, which is um, 0.2 milliliters, um, which is like the vial is 200 milligrams per milliliter. It's in a five milliliter vial. That makes sense. I'll show you right now. Um, so this is testosterone and date, and it's just this tiny little bottle. Um, yeah, it's not even filled up all the way, but there it is. So that's my tea, my man juice. Um. I got this box from Walmart. It was like two fifty, and it's Kyler's box of manhood. See that? Yeah. I have like the uh, symbol for testosterone. I'm not really a nerd. I'm just an organic chemistry, so I'm used to drawing all this crap. Yeah. So um, I'll show you the needles. So there's these needles um, attached to the syringe. And these are 18 gauge needles. They're pretty big. Um, yeah, so we got these. And what you do with that is you take the testosterone out of the vial with that. And then you switch the needle to these smaller ones, which are 20 gauge needles. And you inject into your leg with that. Because I do intermuscular injections to the leg. Um, I'll post up a video later showing how to do the actual shot. Um, when the doctor told me how to do the shot, well, the nurse, she didn't really make any sense, but with my knowledge of, like, from chemistry and biology with the labs and using syringes and measuring stuff like that, um, I just figured it out. But if I didn't have that experience, I would probably be confused when the nurse was, like, telling me how to do it. Um, so I'll show you guys how to do that, just in case. Um, and then the nurse gave me some free alcohol uh, swabs, and then some band-aids. Um, yeah. So, I know my friend went to Walmart to get testosterone, and he said it was a hundred bucks. Um, I don't know if he's on testosterone anthate or cypionate, but I called all of like the 10 pharmacies in the area and Walmart, Target, places like that, they were the most expensive but I called a local pharmacy and um, they compound the testosterone and they there which just means they mix the hormones with like sesame seed oil or whatever type of oil um, to make the actual prescription because the oil um, makes sure that testosterone gets um, like released into your system over time so it doesn't completely release like the day you take your shot and then you have no testosterone left for the week so basically that's why it's there it's like a buffer um what else um okay so yeah I'm just on low dose 40 milligrams per week and I have to go back it was five weeks from then, so it's three and a half weeks from now. And then I guess hold up my dose if everything's fine, which it probably will be. Um, it's tough because even though I'm on testosterone, nothing's happening yet because it is such a low dose. Um, so I haven't noticed anything different. Um, today my appetite was higher, but I think that's just a coincidence. I don't think it was a testosterone. Um, I've been working out since I have this health class where I work out two times a week and yesterday I got a really good workout. I'm sore and hopefully 
I'll start building muscle a little bit quicker, um, but it'll be a lot easier later on when I have more tea. And um, the day before I got my shot, I started logging all of my measurements um, so I could see my progress over time. So I'll show you guys that. Hold on, real quick. Let me see if I'm running over time. <laughs> 